Dear friend, it's early. The president has just spoken. It's the end of July 2011. He's ranting and raving about we need to spell billions and billions of more dollars for this and that. And we'll cut a hundred billion from the defense. He just doesn't tell you it's that ten years down the road. Then he goes on to say, you, you can't cut because student loans would go up. It's like, oh, he doesn't know what he's talking about. I love it. That's completely fraud. He has no clue because it would be just the opposite. If there's more money in the system and the government's not taking as much as they are, then loans go down for the people. And also, of course, you're the Federal Reserve loaning our money, our conscience, at 0% interest rate to your friends so they can loan it to Greece at 15% interest. Pretty good gig if you can get it if you're on the inside. Then he goes on to say, you cannot cut education. It's like, what do you mean? That's one of my platforms. The Ronald Reagan building, the Department of Education, takes two hours to fill. Two hours to empty. Uh, they won't give you stats on it. It's like $180,000 a week in electricity. You want to cut? What does the Department of Education do? Ah, it requires every single university and every single... That's right, every district around the world, or pardon me, around this country, has to have a member in it just to fill out the papers for the Department of Education. It seems like we could cut a great deal of waste. There goes that one, Department of Education. Bye. Oh, Steven Spielberg, John Lucas. Uh, I don't think I got your name, Mr. Lucas, right, but you come on down, we'll talk about it. And uh, you're honest men. You can then put together an education system inside that building where we can have the leaders of the world come there and be talked to and escorted around the city, escorted around the buildings, and given tours by the top 1% of graduation classes across the high schools of the United States of America. Public high schools is the only way you can get the job. You want to guarantee public high schools. That's one way of doing it. And then they'd have to do well to the kids. And then they'd all talk to each other. And then we'd have it be a society of socialization and a society of talking where we brought our young leaders together. This is just one point. I don't have a lot of time today. But this is just the main point. President Obama is completely backwards on the education one and the cutting. We should cut the Department of Education. Don't worry about student loans. They're the only thing you can't go bankrupt on. If you go bankrupt, your student loan, you still owe it.